Welcome to the... Any pounders in the chat? K-E-K-W. Welcome to the... It is... It is Will Art History Hour. Now, it's been a while since we've had an installment of this lovely segment, of this lovely corner of the stream. But as all of you know, anyone that's been around long enough, you know, I'm sort of a patron of the arts. You know what I mean? I can't get enough of the stuff. I just, I feed off of it. I, I, I need it. I, I, I love to be involved, you know? You know, we've done movie poster contest. We've done um, emote contest. We've even done, uh, what was the other one? Art contest in general, just, you know, potpourri, whatever you want to submit. In the chat? But today, I come from you as not only a patron of the arts, but a man in need, desperate need. About a week ago, I was wrongfully removed from Twitter.com. That's right. Removed. Banned. Permanently. A crime against God. My posts. How could they be heard? This was the photo that was my previous header, and it was reported. Honestly, I probably shouldn't even show it. I don't want to get banned here, too. I was removed from the Twitter platform, and I would like to make my triumphant return by making a header, not of my own creation, but of the chats. And I hope that you guys submitted, you know, I got probably uh, hundreds, maybe thousands of submissions, and we are going to go through all of them today. And uh, take a look, vote on the best, and the winner will receive $50. I mean, <laughs> listen, that's a fucking pretty penny for some of the work that you guys did. Let me tell you, I mean, <laughs> you fucking pieces of shit. Anyway, let's check them out, shall we? As you all know, first prize, $50. Second prize, you're banned. Third prize, also banned. Our round one matchup is between number 10, and number 18, let me pull these up. It has, what I like about this one is the texture. If you really zoom in to the fine granules, it has a beautiful physicality to it. It's tactile almost. It looks like a wall at a public school or something. I don't know, like a, like a elementary, I don't know. I, I can't describe it. Here so we have number 18. Another beautiful work. You can see he's included many different elements of the stream. It says Willie Will Swade, which I will say is not my Twitter. It's not my my Twitter's Willie. So whatever, it's fine. Close enough. It appears our winner is this one. Zoom in on the car. Is that Johnny Sins and Soldier Boy in the car? And then, is that and then Wario is in the back? <laughs> All right, clearly we have to look closer. We demand a recount. Recount for this one. Okay, I'm gonna say we'll do, we'll do a recount. Any pounders in the chat. But this is the recount. only recount I will do. One for nose to. Okay, he fucking won. Fine, congrats. All right, sorry to ten, but you got absolutely fucking scammed, brother. I'm gonna be completely honest. <laughs> it's a fucking robbery. Without further ado. I present to you number four. He's created this kind of 3D cinematic universe for the It's Will live stream. I like this one a lot. This one gives me like vaporwave kind of uh, 3D, early 3D modeling vibes. Now he will be going against a festive competitor. Just look at my fucking dude, like taking the photo of me in one of my not so proud moments with the caca glasses and the fedora where <laughs> while these kids are fucking terrified getting their hot chocolate, which is a candy for Halloween in a landslide victory. It seems that Halloween is our winner. We have to do eight versus our mystery competitor to decide who number eight is. Unfortunately, we had a late entry and it really fucked up the whole bracket. I will not say who the mystery competitor was. Here, we have number eight. 
They've placed me in some sort of sick Cronenberg monster where I have hands, but also a, the shell of some sort of disgusting sea creature. It says certified forklift operator, which I am. Now this will be going up against our mystery competitor, which we have right here. It says, I love my girlfriend. Me in love, my girlfriend, our dog Mochi. Number two is the winner. Next up is number three. I don't even know if this is the right size now that I'm looking at it. How's that? Is that is that better? That's a little better. We'll do that one instead. I'll just replace it. This number three will be going up against number 15. Now, number 15. <laughs> for some reason, what gets me the most about it right off the bat is that he typed out my YouTube channel URL in the banner as if somebody would like side by side type that out into their fucking browser window like it's not clickable you can't click on it it just said all right whatever here he has a bodhi vv type creature smoking me out of a pipe i'm the cr i'm a crack rock type thing i mean i'm not gonna say that this is portraying illicit substances i think that i am just being lit on fire and sucked upon by through the through a pipe i think this is pretty fucking good first and foremost but it is going up against some tough competition so we will vote dude there's absolutely no fucking way that you guys voted for this one there's absolutely no fucking way that you voted for this like, what is wrong with you? What, like, what, is, what goes through your head? Here we have number 23. <laughs> Go to jail with the Janium. <laughs> and of course you have. <laughs> oh, man. Any pounders in the chat? This one's really good, man. I'm gonna be honest. I, I really like this one. <laughs> that will be going up against number 18, which we already saw in round one. There you have it. Mr. Monopoly Man will proceed. Number 23 is our winner. Here we have number 32. So here you have me with... Bodhi's head and glasses on and then on the other side of course you have me looking across at him through the void and it will be going up against number 27 <laughs> this is a real photo not much to see here boys the winner by two votes is the cursed face thing god i hope this one doesn't win jesus fucking christ 32 is gonna be the one that moves on ladies and gentlemen 32 is their winner here we have number 19 it says it's will live stream in old english font and it says bmr was here and sideways at the top so i think we all know who that one was made by i, I hate to spoil it but that will be going up against number 25 Dude, could you imagine if he like went to my profile and he saw this on there? Like, could you imagine if he like clicked my, just for some reason, he was like, ah, oh, it's that guy that I, for some reason follow. And then he clicked and he saw this, like as like, oh my God, I literally cannot believe the winner is number two. Moving on, we have number 17. Can you, can you guys stop using this photo? I mean, what, what is this? What? I don't know what this, who is this police? I don't know what Patterson is. Is this something bad? Should I not be showing this? All right, 25, oh wait, sorry. 17 versus 34. Click now to watch multicellular individual defeat runescape bosses and speak on Any subjects such as cum, balls, metaphysics, biology of homin hominoids, and man kissing. 
That is not a real photo. That is edited. No, do not say real photo. Wait, what the hell is that on the side? Is that Mayo Man? Dude, fuck you, honestly. I didn't even notice. And our winner is number one, Laser Eyes. The Laser Eyes It's Will Fedora Kaka Glasses Destruction. Here we have a submission. It just says whale, twitch.tv slash whale, twitter.com slash terrible clicks. I don't know who this guy is. Okay, so you have that. And that will be going up against number 29. Pretty low effort, this one. As if it's lower effort than this. At least this person screenshotted this and cropped it. Anyway, whale is the winner. Who do we have? 14 versus 13? Okay, let me find 14. 14, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> oh, it's actually just so good, man. Fuck. It's like, I really, I was trying so hard not to laugh. That will be going up against number 13. This one really gives me like 2010 RuneScape YouTuber vibes, and I like that about it. I'm gonna be honest. It really got a bad matchup, unfortunately, but I think it's good. But this, you're the second person to say Will Swade when my Twitter is Willy. It's Willy. I will. I don't think Will Swade was available or something. I don't know. I mean, listen, I, my fucking, I, I have the worst Twitter handle of all time. But uh, you know, that's okay. It appears our winner has been decided, folks. I don't need to be the one to tell you that the hot dog has moved on. Number 14 is our winner. Next up, we have this guy who very clearly made this probably on his phone. And then instead of saving the image, he decided to screenshot it. Here you have the Kaka glasses, a very old photo of me eating a banana. I'm driving in a van. It says the official Twitter of It's Will Come 7. Just about the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. And that will be going up against number 20, number 26. What is this? Am I crying? And it has been one minute and the van is the winner. We got a strong matchup here. I'm not going to lie. Number 24. <laughs> here you have uh, Mrs. Incredible, uh, OJ Simpson, notorious the innocent man uh and myself of course driving in my car that i own and it says quote runescape super pro soldier boy quite a good submission i will not lie i do like this one a lot this one will be going up against it's will top five runescape streams with me as every seinfeld character and he appears to have photoshopped me with a absolute dump truck ass. These are both very strong. <laughs> I just... You guys voted for this one? I'm actually surprised, honestly. I, I liked this one way more, to be completely honest with you. Here we have eight, which we've already seen. And that one is going against this much less wholesome one. That will do it, ladies and gentlemen. The winner is actually the Halloween one. Halloween fucking takes it. This one was made by Hannah right before I went live and I had to, I think she made it on stream. But I mean, she made it to the second round pretty good. Number seven versus number 20. <laughs> what is this, man? Okay. Here we have number seven. I don't have much to say. It's 90s, you know what I mean? It's the spirit of the 90s, alive and well. I definitely understand where he's coming from, but it's gonna, it's not gonna be an easy win for number seven because it's going up against number 21, which you will see right here. It's Will is so cool, I am Soldier Boy. A text bubble, an actual quote, probably at some point. Well, boys, it's been one minute and the winner is come. Number 22, ladies and gentlemen, I present you. This is fucked up, man. This is not, I don't look like that. I don't have that style of mustache. I don't look like the fucking Pringles guy. That one will be going up against number 16. 
It's Will Streamer, two E30s with Mochi driving each one. Different Mochi photos. This one's really... Why does it say, welcome to Moparscape, start server, enter? Wait, no, he was referencing the Moparscape login screen because he put the two cars in there. Dude, that's actually fucking genius. Wow. No, that totally went over my head. I'm going to be honest. Wow, that's a... I mean, this one's really good. That took it to a, the next level for me. Absolutely insane that this was a thing. Wow. Anyway, the winner is just by a landslide, the cars. I'm sorry to say to the to the man that actually worked hard and drew this himself. I feel kind of bad. Honestly, it was a really good drawing. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you number 12. Wow, an incredible work, I have to say, incredible. Here is the competition. I don't really have to say much about this one. Any pounders in the chat? And just like that, one is actually the winner? Oh my God, dude. Number 11, ladies and gentlemen. I kind of like this one. Making an actual banner isn't really in the spirit of the competition. What the fuck are you talking about? All right, whatever. It's going up against this one, which is also an actual banner, so. It appears our winner is actually, I'm shocked by the winner. Number one. I'm absolutely fucking amazed that this is the, oh my God, I really thought this one would win. You guys actually voted for the better one for once. I can't fucking believe it. That shit is insane, dude. I'm gonna be honest. I do not know what this is, but this is number two. Fart, no, lard. Search for that cat smiling. I don't know what this one is, to be honest. I don't get it at all. That one is up against number 31, I believe, which we have right here. It's Will, I am Will, Will I am, Twitch plus YouTube. Dab. Tuna Potato. Tuna Potato wins. Number 20. This guy likes pancakes. And number 33. It's Will Streamer Garfield. Three, two, one. Oh my fucking God, dude. That is the closest one that we've had. You have number one. Are we gonna keep doing this? Is this all is this all you guys wanna do all fucking day? Is that what is that who we are? Number one and number 35. What a f <laughs> Seems we have a bit of a collage going here. What do you know? Number two, the collage. And there you have it. Starting off round two, we have number 23, a fan favorite versus number 32, somebody that definitely is still in the competition. I will have number 23, which we've seen before. The primes are due. Go to jail. Enjoy the perm versus think of this as the good side and think of this next one as the evil who will triumph who will come out on top well the monopoly pretty much took it by a fucking landslide i'm gonna be completely honest it wasn't even close moving right along we have number 25 and 17 boys 25 which we all know and all love myself and my close personal friend soldier boy versus myself destroying the city with the caca glasses and the fedora the laser beam eyes i'm shocked honestly I, I thought you guys would like the other one next up we have number five versus number 14. here we have number five it just says whale twitch.tv slash whale that one will be going up against number 14 the fucking <laughs> oh man and it is the wiener and not the whale. I'm very sorry to whale, shout out to whale. Number 28, you remember it and you love it. That is as big as a photo as I can show you of it because the guy submitted it in the worst possible size photo I've ever seen in my life. That one will be going up against number nine, a fucking real popular one of round. <laughs> I'm just gonna call this one early, honestly. This one's fucking over, dude, Jesus Christ. No love for the van and the Seinfeld moves on once again. Come, 
Number six versus number seven, ladies and gentlemen. A crazy matchup. This one could go either way. You have this very accurate representation, this festive piece, and that one is going up against... Come. Is there a nom? Oh shit, if you see this nom. I didn't even notice that. Halloween is our winner. Moving on, number 16 versus number 12. 16, the Moparscape. This one? Or this one? A beautiful piece of minimalism. The Cars is the winner and it's going to move on. Number 16 takes it. Here we have number 11 versus the Tuna Potato. One that some might say is only here because it went up against the absolute worst submission that anyone has seen in this competition. Number 11 moves on. Who is going to be the winner? Number 20, ladies and gentlemen, who barely squeaked by in a 51-49 win. Or will it be the collage of classic It's Will photos? I could see this one going either way. And thus he is the winner. So we have round four, the final four, or wait, no, the top, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, the top eight. <laughs> All I know is first up, we have 23, Monopoly. That one's just good, I have to say. That one's really good. But it's going up against what has been a, a bit of a demon in the bracket, just taking out good submissions left and right. The laser eyes. People fucking love the laser eyes. Did you see that round where Monopoly actually surpassed laser eyes? In a 71.5 to 20 something, I can't read it, it's too small. And we have 14 versus nine. Honestly, I'm sad that these ones have to meet so early. These could be championship level matchups. That's the problem with the random seating, ladies and gentlemen. Number 14, the Glizzy Globbler up against number nine, Seinfeld. And the winner is the Glizzy Globbler. Wow. Next up, we got number six versus number 16. We have the festive. Listen, Halloween is right around the corner, ladies and gentlemen, and you know what that means. I'm giving out fucking hot chocolates. That's right. Versus Moparscape? Mochi edition? This is a toughie, man. I'm gonna be honest. Moparscape will move on. The Pet Getter It's Will. Listen, a classic theme versus the true bracket demon of the It's Will Twitter header competition 2021, ladies and gentlemen. I repeat, the pancakes. Oh my fucking... Oh my god, I ended the poll. Oh shit, you guys couldn't see... We're gonna do a recount. I, cause I, you guys won't believe me if I say what won. I'm gonna be honest. You guys literally won't believe me. I literally cannot believe it won twice. Not once, but twice. It literally, I literally eliminated on accident and it won 51% after a minute. I cannot fucking believe that Pancakes has gone this far, dude. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have the semifinals. I repeat, the final four. This is where I'm, I'm getting nervous. I feel butterflies, I'm sweating. I can feel the 50 grand leaving my pocket. You know what I mean? It's only $50 for the record. Just if you're editing this for YouTube, just keep in where I said 50 grand. Do not put in the part where I say this though. Edit this part out. 23 versus 14. These are absolutely insane, dude. You have the Monopoly and you have the fucking Glizzy Globbler. Monopoly takes it by like five votes, dude. It was actually so close. This one was my prediction to win, I'm gonna be honest. But unfortunately, every Cinderella story has to come to an end. And speaking of Cinderella stories, ladies and gentlemen, we have what has been perhaps the biggest upset in the history of art as we know it. The pancakes continue to shock and awe with every matchup. So here I present to you, Moparscape. You know it. 
you're familiar with it. Maybe you're not. But one thing that everyone is familiar with is option number two. A fat stack of seven pancakes. I can't make this up, folks. I cannot make this up. The pancakes have moved on to the finals, ladies and gentlemen. I repeat, we have our final bracket and our bronze match. First, we will decide who wins third place. Who will be banned? The Glizzy Globbler or the Moparscape? People like the Glizzy, man. I'm shocked it didn't win, honestly, but it did get third. And I'm sure this comes as a mystery to many people. But the creator of the Glizzy is actually Hugh Jass. Enjoy the 24 hours, Hugh. I love you. I hope you're doing well. I think yours was uh, honestly my favorite to win. I thought it was very good. The winner of this will receive $50 USD, and I will make them their submission, my header on Twitter. And the loser of this will be banned from the live stream forever. 24 hours. I leave it up to you. Will it be the Monopoly? Or will it be the pancakes that just never could quit? And the voting has ended, folks. The winner is Monopoly. Oh my God, you thought. You fucking thought it was the pancakes. Oh my God, you thought. No way. No way. You actually thought the pancakes was gonna win? What are you, stupid? It's just a picture of pancakes. It's, it's all pixelated. It's terrible. What do you mean? Come on. Can I get a fucking Intel 7 at I'm Tones, a legend. Respect. Voice chat with Timeline. Timeline needs you. Yeah, what's up, man? So some information came to my desk recently. So since the banner was union made, you need to pay out $50 to every single person in the union, unfortunately. I, had, I hadn't announced the name, actually, though. Oh. I was about, I was getting to that. That's where I was, I was about to get there. I was I was gonna make it my header and then I was gonna say, wait, it said your name isn't even on here, Any man. Pounders in the chat? Well, no, I'm representing the Pancakes won the election, Kona. Well, sent it. It's Centipede <laughs> sent it. The winner is Centipede in the chat with an S, and he said made by myself and Rich Homie Keenan. They both made it. So you're telling me you're a union rep? Yes. Listen, here's the well, here's what I can do for you, Toots. Because this was made by two people and it was not, you know, this information was not given to me previously until the victory was named. Mm -hmm. I am willing to double the prize money. I will give $50 to Centipede and $50 to Rich Homie Keenan, and I will let them distribute it to the union however they so please. I, I believe that is a deal that we will be willing to make. Deal. All right. And you know what that's called? That's What's called that? the art of the deal. It is, because listen, I could have just had to pay $50 to like 50 different people, and I got out of it for 100 What a bunch of idiots. Oh my God. Scammed them. Absolutely fleeced them, guys. Let's fucking go.